how do we improve YouTube? Well, to me, it's for, for me, it, it's going to be things that's quite different than what a number of other people feel about it. To me, how we improve YouTube is that we put the you back in YouTube by being ourselves more. By not trying to put up fake fronts. By not trying to present ourselves as different than we really are. By being completely emotionally honest. By showing our vulnerability. I pronounced that wrong. By not being so anonymous about the way that we talk about things. Showing our faces. Being real. Being willing to take criticism. As well. Because sometimes when we're real, we're shown, holy shit, I guess I was really wrong about this. I didn't know other people really felt this way about this, or I never, I never knew to look at things differently than I currently have. I thought everyone looked at it this certain way. You know, if we talk about subjects that we don't hear other people talking about, even if it's not very important, just finding subjects that are not common to be talked about. Things that we think about that we don't hear people mention. Putting ourselves in our videos. Being ourselves. As far as, you know, how YouTube can be improved, well, that's a big list. But that's not anything that we can do to improve it. That's something that Google would have to do. You know, bringing back video responses would certainly, uh, would certainly help that. And a number of people have already said this. If they can't bring back video responses, I think it would be neat if they were able to put in an option that's kind of, uh, I mean, I've mentioned this before, where instead of just having text comments, you could have video comments. And they have to be recorded live. I mean, I'm sh people can find ways of getting around that, but for the most part, you know, most people will just use it to, to make a live response. Some where people are being themselves. And the video will be basically a wide version of the size of the icon that's usually uh, in, in the comment section, you know? Or if they want to, they could just have an audio uh, uh, comment, you know, video and audio comments. You know, more direct interaction, where people can really tell inflections, and, and, and we're not having to guess what people's emotions are in something. We'll more often be able to tell when someone is joking or not, when they're being facetious, when they're being sarcastic. But I don't think YouTube's ever going to do that. Google's not going to do that. That that offers them no money whatsoever. All that does is eat up more of their bandwidth. So they're not going to want that. They can't attach ads to it, so, you know, um, no matter how popular a comment might be, they can't attach an ad to it. They can't attach something that will, that gives them, you know, makes them see money signs, so, you know, that's not going to happen. Um... Adding a another a way that they took away of us being able to connect with each other more, where you don't, they don't force Google Plus as the way of being able to have YouTube friends. You know, have bring YouTube back to being a little bit more of a social network instead of a video sharing network with that's that uses Google Plus as the social network. You know, I do like Google+, Plus, but it's not for everyone. And... It, I don't think everyone should be forced 
to use Google Plus as the method of the social network that's associated with YouTube. But that's what they've been doing. They make money from it. They have some sort of plan, and that's just what they're doing, and there's nothing we can do about it. So, as far as, you know, how do we improve YouTube? All we can do is just try to be ourselves more. That's all we can really do. Some people are saying, oh, well, we need to, we need to get rid of the, the so much drama and, and conflict. And you know what? That's, that's what keeps a lot of people interested in, in YouTube. You know? It, I've had these, I, I've obviously had these points where I say, oh, I don't want any more conflict. Well, you know, I can say that. I can say that, but it's bullshit. Anyone who tries to say that that conflict and drama is destroying YouTube, yeah, you you don't. <laughs> drama and conflict on television is what keeps people watching television. It's obviously going to be what keeps people interested in YouTube as well. And. There have been many points where I haven't wanted to face that, but it's the truth. So, anyway. <laughs>